Greetings. My name is Paul, and I am the lead research technician here at the Haddle Linux Research Labs, and I'm also the administrator of the Pop OS Linux Facebook group on Facebook. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to install the Cosmic Desktop environment on Endeavor OS Linux. Okay, let's get started. Okay, so I'm going to show you how to install the newly released Cosmic Desktop from System76 onto Arch Linux. And in this uh, particular case, it's going to be Endeavor OS, which is a variant of Arch. Uh, keep in mind that Cosmic Desktop is it's good. It's got you know it, it's it's a uh, written in Rust, so that's the good part. And the the bad part is that it's still in alpha too, so it's not necessarily production ready. There will be bugs and features that are missing. Um, so we're looking forward to uh, another. We're looking forward to a beta release in the near future. But yeah, just keep in mind it's not production ready. So if you put it on your on your bare metal, you know, uh, installation. Just keep in mind that it might not, you know, work that great. Um, I would suggest that you maybe you put into a VM, or you know, you know, a VM where you can kind of play, play, play around with it, or on a bare metal installation where it's kind of expendable, like a kind of a test playground. Okay. Um, so yeah, that's about it. Yeah, it's written in Rust, and it's an alpha too, and. Like I said, um, we're looking forward to uh, beta in the near future, but right now it's alpha 2. Okay, so I'm going to install it here. Now the first thing you have to do is, okay, here's my, um, here's my terminal window with my fast fetch output here. And the first line here shows that I'm actually in an Endeavor OS session here, okay, Endeavor OS. Linux, which is an Arch based variant. Okay, so we're going to put Cosmic on here. Right now I'm running XFace. Okay, so this DE is XFace. And once you log in, it'll be DE right here. We'll, be, we'll say Cosmic. Okay, and you're pretty good at everything else here. Okay, so that's my, uh, that's my fast fetch screen there. Now, in order to install Cosmic, you're going to have to have the chaotic AUR repo installed and enabled. I have another video in my um, my video library where I show you how to install the chaotic AUR repo onto Endeavor. So before you do this, look at that video and install chaotic AUR. Now let me show you that it's actually on mine. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and, and um, run a standard Pac-Man uh, update upgrade command here and I'm going to show you that it, it's going to be um, being able to pull from the chaotic AUR along with some uh, four other enabled and installed and en enabled repos here so you see chaotic here so you see Pac-Man's aware of chaotic okay and then the same thing for um, the same thing for yay which is like a, an alternative package manager for Linux it's an AUR package manager essentially, but it seems like Pac-Man and EA kind of do the same thing, if you ask me. Anyway, if you put EA in by itself without without uh, being root, no sudo, and it's just, it pulling, and it's the same thing, pretty much that uh, Pac-Man is doing, I think. I think even Pac-Man looks for AUR. I'm not sure. Maybe only EA does AUR actually. Okay, so anyway. Um, you can see A is also aware that there's a chaotic AUR repo in the sources list for it to pull from. So essentially, before you do, just keep in mind before you do anything with Cosmic, you have to have this chaotic AUR installed. Okay, so look at my video, my video library. It's called How to Install Chaotic AUR on Endeavor OS. Okay, so once you've got it. Chaotic installed, then we can go ahead and install Cosmic. Now we can do it two ways. You can use Pac-Man or Yay. Here is okay, there's there's uh, two ways. Pac-Man and Yay, and there's also two kind of commands. If you do just set Cosmic by by itself, like this, the standard Pac-Man installation command, 
pseudo Pac-Man dash capital S Cosmic. If you just, just do Cosmic by itself, it'll give you a list of the different components in the group. Uh, you know, we don't need to go, we can skip the ones over here, you know, we got the um, files, a greeter, we got terminal, screenshot, so the, all the different components, and you can choose components by themselves if you want. I'm not going to do it this way, I'm gonna just going to go and do the whole group. So to do the whole group, it's going to be cosmic dash session, okay? Okay, so cosmic just gives you the individual group members, I'm going to do the whole group by itself, uh, as a whole. Okay, so that was Pac-Man, and the same thing with Yay as well. So Yay dash capital S Cosmic, and it's just yeah, it's the same thing. Pac-Man and, and um, Cosmic. I mean, Pac Yay and Pac-Man give you the same output when you when you try to install the Cosmic package like this. It gives you the individual components. Okay, so we're not going to do. I'm not going to, you can, you know, on your own if you want to choose just specific elements, uh, comp components, you can just, you know, like, if you want just one, then just key in one here, otherwise enter and you'll give you everything anyway. So, I'm not going to do it that way. I'm going to uh, clear out of there, okay. Uh, you can use Pac-Man here with the Cosmic Session command instead the package for the cosmic session package instead of just cosmic okay and it's the same thing for yay let's just enter on this and then I can I can get out of it once once I show what I'm gonna what the output of session is okay so we get this um next screen here where we have to pick Vulcan driver um, the Vulcan driver uh, software and there's 14 providers um okay so I have both of these enabled, so I can I can pick either one. The default would be one would be extra, and I've got extra installed and enabled, and I also have chaotic AUR also installed and enabled. So probably if I go either one, I'll be okay. I'm probably going to go with um, the first one because my NVIDIA card is old, and I don't know if it's going to work. It probably won't work anyway. So I'll, once I'm done with the video, I'm going to try to log in. I probably won't even get a login screen. I tried the same thing on OpenSUSE on this system here, and I couldn't even get a login screen. So I'm thinking I'm going to get the same thing when I try to, you know, log into Cosmic on on my Endeavor system since it's it's on the same hardware. But anyway, I can show you how to install it. Hopefully, you'll have the hardware that you'll be able to take advantage of and log into a Cosmic session. But for me, I would just choose the first one here, Extra. So that that's what I'm going to choose here. I'm going to choose uh, Extra. So it'll be one there. Okay, but I'm not, I don't want to do it with Pac-Man. So I'll clear on that. Cycle through my saved. Actually, uh, yeah, I can just go here. Cosmic. And then Session. Okay, this is the command I'm going to use to install Cosmic, ultimately, here. Yay. Dash. Capital S to install Cosmic Session. Not Cosmic, but Cosmic Session. Okay. This should install the entire group on my system. So enter on that, and I get the same prompt as I, I got before. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead, and since I've already got extra uh, enabled and you know installed and enabled, I can just go ahead and just use that that repo and see what that does. Okay, so the default is one. I'm going to go put key in one anyway. Okay, so I'm good there. I'm all staged up for my um, choice for uh, Vulcan driver. Enter on that. Okay, it's gonna. It's gonna. It tells me it's gonna go ahead and install 33 packages, dependencies and whatnot, core or whatever. Give it the ones over there. What's well, gonna install the um, the cosmic packages here, the individual ones here, that we saw on that other screen, and then I guess in here somewhere is gonna be the the drivers for Vulkan as well. We well, can give this the once over on your own. So it's gonna be cosmic and the Vulcan drivers should be should be all bundled into this batch of uh, packages that that are gonna be installed. Okay, so proceed with installation. Okay, uh, yes or no? Since the Y is capitalized, that's my default. So I don't even have to key anything in here. I just enter, hit the enter uh, key there, and uh, the Y since Y is capitalized, that that'll be the um, default selection for for that. For that prompt. 
Okay, so it's going to download and install Cosmic and Vulkan, looks like. So it already downloaded all the packages. Now it's going to go ahead and install those 33 packages. And I want to keep it going, keep the video running here. Looks like it's going pretty fast, actually. Okay, so I'm not going to stop the video quite yet. Looks like everything went there pretty fast. 7 to 10, 8 to 10, 9 to 10, okay, one more maybe. Okay, that was pretty fast. Okay, good. So we downloaded and installed uh, the Cosmic Group and the Vulcan drivers that way. Okay, I'm going to clear on that. And I'm going to go back to my Fast Fetch screen here. Okay, as I close the video out. That was pretty much about it. The real work is adding the chaotic AUR. That's where you really have to spend a few minutes. This is this is pretty fast. So, uh, you know, install the chaotic AUR, then then follow the instructions here, and then do a reboot. And on your login screen for uh, Endeavor, there should be a, a button, uh, an, an icon, a symbol, something to click on, or a cogwheel. Click on that. Hopefully, you'll see Cosmic. Select that, and then hopefully you'll get a login screen. And you can log into your uh, Cosmic Desktop that way. So yeah, okay. So that was um, so that was essentially how to install the Cosmic Desktop environment on Endeavor OS Arch Linux. Okay. And so once again, I am Paul, and I am the uh, lead technician here at the uh, How to Linux Research Labs, and I'm also the administrator of the Pop OS Linux Facebook group on Facebook. Please join, even if you don't run Pop. You can still join and um, talk to other Linux users. I do allow discussions about different distros, tech news, tech personalities. So even if you don't run POP, please join. And I would also like to ask you to like, um, to like my video, comment on my video, subscribe to my video channel, and until my next video, a happy Linuxing. Um, out. Thank you.